Hillbilly DVD Reviews Unboxing Series. Today we got the awesome 3D German lenticular version of Abraham Lincoln Vampire Hunter, directed by Steven Spielberg, starring Daniel Day Lewis. It's, you know, almost swept the Oscar. So many nominations and shit. So let's get to it. Shrink rack coming off. Thankfully, all the shit was on the wrapper, not on here. They didn't put no stickers and shit. Very fucking cool. We've covered some of these 3D lenticular steelbook releases before. In case you didn't know how it worked, this is actually a magnet here. Comes off. I'm gonna hold this up to the camera. Sometimes you can see it's 3D on the camera. Sometimes you can't. Hopefully, you can see it. It does have some real good depth to it. One of the better ones that I've seen so far. So anyway, you can take that off if you just want to have a regular steelbook version of it. As you see here, Abraham Lincoln, Vampire, Jaeger, fucking Jaegermeister, I guess, did a you know promotion over in Germany and fucking had him change the title. But over here is Vampire Killer and shit. I saw this movie in 3D, so it's very cool, you know, to remind me of how I saw it in theaters and shit. I thought this movie was good, but I couldn't understand, like, all the Oscar hype and shit. I mean, it's good, but I wouldn't be nominated for a bunch of Oscars and shit. But whatever, the Academy is crazy for anything Steven Spielberg, Daniel Day-Lewis do. Typical spine right here. If you listen real closely, you can hear the fucking pedophile ice cream truck right outside my place trying to fucking pick up some little kids and shit. We got the back here, typical back, you know, pictures and shit, you know, uh, fucking description. All this shit is in German and shit. Uh, funnily enough, and you know, you never know till you text it, this comes with a 3D version. It says it's region B locked, but the 2D version is ABC. You can play that shit around the world. Alright, pedophile ice cream truck, get the fuck out of here. We don't want you to scoop up any kids. We're trying to film a fucking video. Pop this shit open, what do you get? Surprise, surprise, the movie that won't die. Fucking advertisement in German for Dust uh, uh, Ultimate 3D or Beans of fucking Avatar. James Cameron, you son of a bitch. Either make the sequel shit or get off the pot. I'm tired of hearing about Avatar. And then more fucking advertisements for 3D movies. Very nice. They got it down to two discs. Usually you get 3D set, man. They got all these fucking discs and shit, you know, DVD, all this. They just went straight with the Blu-ray on this, which I like. Fuck that DVD. I don't want it. I don't want digital capitales and shit. So there's a 3D disc right there. Very cool fucking artwork. I love it, man. Fucking Steven Spielberg, Daniel Day-Lewis. They went so hardcore with this movie. I'm proud of them. Then we got the 2D disc there. Uh, Daniel Day-Lewis playing the younger version of Abraham Lincoln, Vampire Jaeger, just chopping motherfuckers. And I'll tell you, man, he played the role from, like, about 15 years old to fucking, you know, when Lincoln, right before he got shot by John Wilkes Booth and shit. I gotta say, man, you know, you, you know some motherfuckers are Hollywood overrated, but Daniel Day-Lewis ain't one of them, man. He can do anything. Some inside artwork that kind of mirrors the releases, kind of, here with the hat and shit. Here, it's the exact same 2D artwork, just bigger, black and white. I love it, man. You know, I wouldn't say this is a classic. I wouldn't say that it deserved to fucking sweep the Academy Awards and shit, but this is a good movie, man. And fuck it, man. If the Academy Awards are going to nominate, a, you know, an R-rated fucking 3D vampire, you know, movie, maybe the Academy Awards ain't so fucking bad. So, yeah. So, if you're a big Oscar collector, movie collector, whatever, you got to get this fucking shit, I guess.